Hello creative people, welcome back with another video editing tutorial by Mr. Rabbi. In this video, we are going to make a strobe light effect inside of Adobe Premiere Pro CC. So, let's get started. First you will have to import your footage and audio files in the project timeline. In this video I am recording internal sound too. So if you feel any problem then I am sorry for that. Go to the position where the beat drops. Here the beat drops. So I am going to use the strobe light effect in this position. Press C to open razor tool. Now click on the position where you want to cut. In this position the beat end, so I will cut in this position too. Now go to effects and search for strobe light effects. Then drag the effect onto the clips. Change the strobe duration. It means how long you want your strobe light to stay. Use 0.20 seconds, where there is a normal beat drops. And you can use 0.05 seconds, where there is a speed beat drops. You should use double value, for your strobe period, then the value of your strobe duration. You can also change the color of the strobe light. For this clip I will use white. You are free to change the strobe type into transparent, but I will use color mode now. If your strobe light is not working on the clip, you should use random strobe probability to make it work. Adjust the value as your clip. I am using 0.05 strobe duration for my normal beat drops. And 0.03 for my speedy beat drops. You are free to choose your settings. We should render the clip to watch it. Press I, to mark in. And press O, to mark out. Then go to sequence, and click, render into out. Now you will see our clip is rendering. After render is complete, you will see the strobe light working, on the beat drops. Now right click on the mouse and click on, clear in, and out. Hope you enjoyed the video. Give a thumbs up to my video. Also make sure to subscribe my channel. Thank you, see you next time. Till then take care, and have some fun with animation and VFX. Goodbye.